this weekend. Oh, I'm off work. Woohoo! So it's a bit of a mixed weekend this is. At the moment, I am fishing with the lads. Hey! <laughs> We're out pike fishing on the Trent in Newark. Um, we've already had one. Uh, we've got here at the crack of dawn. And uh, yeah, gonna have a good day's fishing. Might do a few other bits this weekend. So uh, come along for the ride. Just hooked in to a Xander, my first ever Xander. Now this is freaking incredible. It's huge. <sighs> The hook come off, strain the net. We're gonna weigh it out and get some pictures. I am freaking over the moon right now. We're really roughing it at the river. You know, it's, it's bread and water if we're lucky. What are you eating there, Shane? Just got a, <laughs> just, just a uh, five sausage. Just, <laughs> just gone small with the five sausage. The four rashers of bacon, <laughs> plate full of beans, the cob, and I've got an egg on the way. That's a bread roll, mate. It's a bread roll. It's a cob. <laughs> oh, God. Well, I, I am north, so I'll let them have it. And, and they, they, they've got me a Xander today, so I'll let them have that. <laughs> he loves the cooking, look at this. <sighs> right, let's eat. We have had an absolute cracking session at this uh, part of the Trent. So I've had four pike, beat my new personal best, which is now about 11 pounds. And my, I've caught two Xander now. Uh, again, the first one was the beast, uh, ten and a half pounds, and uh, now we're going to pack up. We're going to head back, drop some stuff off. Nice train interrupts me. Then we're going to head out to another little river, see if we can do a bit of spinning and a little bit more uh, uh, dead baiting, and see if we can catch a few more. Good morning, guys. Good morning. Oh, what a day's fishing that was yesterday. Absolute incredible i mean that xander i mean i know this isn't a fishing channel and i really don't want to bore you with it all but that xander the uk record is like 21 pounds so i caught a 10 and a half pound man i mean that might be a fish of of the life of my lifetime i might never ever get anything better than than that again um so yeah that was an incredible feeling it really was had a brilliant weekend with um, with Shane and Dave. It really was an absolute banger. Them two are legends with fishing, and I just love hanging out with them. Um, we're gonna we've got loads more plans ready for next year that we're gonna do some fishing and some uh, little trips. So that's gonna be good. But now, right? Oh, do you know what? First time ever. Uh, I got a, license, a fishing license check yesterday. First time ever, and it was by the police. So they've had a few problems with uh, people using nets and traps uh, and stealing fish from rivers and ponds and lakes and everything to eat them. Um, yeah, it sucks. They really shouldn't be doing that. If you want to eat, eat that and everything, then just go go down the supermarket, you know, jog on. This is, you know, you're taking the fish away, then they can't replenish, and then that's it. They're, they're all done. Um, but yeah, police came down. We were fishing on a little river on the second river we went to. Um, and yeah, they all have done license checks. It's the first time in about 10 years I've had a license check. So it's nice to see that they're doing it and they're taking it seriously. So yeah, make sure you got your licenses, people. Otherwise, you're not going to be, uh, it's not going to be good for you. Time we had a little chat. I've been pestered by you guys all on the comments um, and my DMs. I've even had some voice messages from my mates saying, what's going on? What is this? Is a sleep tracker, not a wedding ring, not an engagement ring. I have not got married. I've not eloped. I am not, <laughs> not going to be getting married. Last week, I went to the nurse for my diabetic review. And along with trying to improve my health through eating and exercise, I want to improve my sleep, which is where my new Emma mattress comes in. When Emma reached out and said they wanted to collaborate on this video, it was just like it was meant to be because I was, you know, I just bought this um, and I'm I'm thinking about trying to improve my sleep. And then Emma, with, the, with their mattresses, they just reach out, they're like, you know, do you want to work together? And I'm like, yes. I'm a night driver, so I, I sleep during the day. Now I don't have, I don't have any trouble falling asleep. But I have trouble staying asleep and I wake up quite often and then I'm up and about and I'm just not really not really sleeping so I need to improve my sleep and when Emma reached out and wanted to collaborate on this video it was like it was at 
absolutely meant to be because I want to work on my sleep so much and try and improve it along with everything else I'm trying to improve this is just it was it was just a match made in heaven it really was it's so soft this mattress is I mean I'm lucky enough to have in the top of my motorhome a space for a full-size double now like I said I've normally only ever had the mattress that come with it um, which was, was okay um, but like I said it's, it's not it's nothing compared to this this is just so soft and so so luxurious compared I'm gonna be using this now and I know my sleep's gonna improve because just it's like it's like sleeping on a cloud it really is you definitely need to check out Emma not only do they have a 10-year warranty with their mattresses but they come with a 200 night risk-free sleep trial I mean that's a smart purchase straight away if you are in the market for a new mattress you think it's about time to get yourself a new one then why not take advantage of their Black Friday sale up to 60% off plus an exclusive discount if you use my code Urban Sleep. Not only does it come with a 10 year warranty but also comes with a 200 night risk free sleep trial so you are protected no matter what. Brilliant. I'm really grateful for Emma reaching out and uh, collaborating on this video. Workshop. Workshop. <laughs> <laughs> Work worker. Yeah, 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 yeah. In the yeah. workshop. Oh, uh -huh. yeah, but yeah. technically it's not the same as a work worker. Yeah, you don't get paid. <laughs> <laughs> so this is it, guys. Obviously, you've seen this on his channel. But yeah, wow. Well. <laughs> the workshop. The workshop. The place where vans are built. With uh, really bad beverages. Is this go go juice ready to start the van? Yeah. <laughs> Look at the breakfast of champions as well. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, are they up to date on the videos at the moment? Or no. is there a sneak peek? No, if you I mean, mine ain't going to be going out for probably two weeks. Oh, you might be just about up to date then. Oh, yeah. You've shown them that, haven't you? Because yeah. I saw a picture on your Instagram of the EcoFlow kit. Which I was I was lucky enough to go and uh, view out in Germany, which is an absolute banger of a kit. Look a, at it. A lot of people said, "How come Daz went to Germany?" <laughs> so yeah. Daz has seen what you've bought before you've even seen it. <laughs> yeah. I was really uh, chuffed. To, oh, lights! We have power. We have power. Look at this. These panels. Now I'm not doing a van build. But if I was, I mean, these look so much easier than, yeah. than making bits of wood look yeah. fancy. Tongue and, Tongue and groove. groove, yeah. Everyone goes, for Everyone goes for that, but this looks really cool. I mean, it actually looks like a proper, you know, like um, comes from manufacturer finish. Yeah, factory built. Yeah, yeah factory built finish. What's that, the time like? That, that is the, that, that is the that, question. See, now I do have to actually learn woodworking. <laughs> Because I've got to build cabinets and a toilet room and yeah. a kitchen and all that. And let me just say, because I walked in here and I was like, oh, this is cool, this is an Erdin's cave. And then I looked at all this stuff. That is why I'm not building my own van. It's not just put some insulation on, throw some wood up, put a bed in and you're done. No. It really is not that. I mean, it is so much more. Everything needs planning out. But yeah. tell them the thing that you decided to take the piss out of me for. Oh, what, what what part of my toolkit did you think? <laughs> oh, I need to mess that up. Yeah, look at all these. They're all so neat and organised. I saw them straight away. I was like, I need to mess them in a different order. So how long do you reckon? I think I've got probably about a month left. A month? Yeah. And then you'll be hitting the road. And Sp be, oh, spider, spider. Yeah, that'll be it. Yeah, <laughs> but I'm just white van man now. People yeah. still say... <laughs> People say, oh, I've just seen you around the M25. I'm like, nope. <laughs> no, you haven't. No. That was the old one. He's called Lee. Give him a wave if you see him. <laughs> There's no hair, all right? You what? Lost? <laughs> ah, that can stay in me. <laughs> oh, look at him from there. Look who I'm with. <laughs> hey. Hey. We're in the workshop and we've got food. Pizza. And that's a hell of a pizza. Ooh. I've got a little morsel of food, you know, in the van. I need some bread and water, you know. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm eating pizza, man. Right, let's crack on. Right, time to hit the road. I've got work tonight. So it's goodbye. Bye. Nice seeing you. <laughs> yeah, now get out. Yeah. <laughs> I've got work to do. <laughs> yeah. yeah, come on, pull your finger out, mate. What do you think this is? Break time? Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> crack on, mate. We want to see the van on the road. Oh, no, I do too. <laughs> I so want to see it on the road. <laughs> right, I'll, I'm uh, heading back to work now, and I'll, uh, yeah, we'll, oh, I don't know what I'll do down there, but we'll, yeah, let's head back down to work, because I can't wait. <laughs>
that is me parked up, ready for work tonight. Why not check out this video and this video, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye.